finish our first qualifying session as uh, officially as Extreme Speed Motorsports. Didn't end up as well as we'd hoped. We ran fastest one day, top three in practice a lot. We ended up seventh and ninth. We did pretty good. I mean, we couldn't come here and expect to be on pole, but you know, as a driver, you think we're gonna dial the car in, we're gonna get everything right, and we're gonna go out and smoke everybody. And it's, it, we're up against the best in the business, you know? And I think we had a real good solid performance. And the important thing is that you don't get any points or trophies for qualifying on pole. So we have 12 hours of racing tomorrow. We know we have a very reliable, very easy car to drive that all of us drivers are comfortable with, Ed, Joao, and myself. It's a long race, and all that matters, we have a trouble free run. And uh, you know, we've shown that we're consistently fast over longer runs. So yeah, we feel pretty good all in all. Winter testing has been cold. It's really the first day it's all of a sudden gaining some temperature. Track temperature's way up and just made the track a little greasier for us. It's supposed to be even warmer for tomorrow's race. So something we certainly have to deal with, and I guess it's better to find out today. And ultimately, we're still looking really positive for tomorrow. It's one of those things, you know, you want to be top dog when you're out there. A 12-hour race doesn't matter where you start. The guys who won this class last year started in the pit lane. So we just need to make sure we get the car as best we can and, and make sure we run around all day long, and I think we'll be just fine.